we want justice, say these furious anti-rape protesters in New Delhi, before being dispersed by police using water cannon and tear gas. Thousands, including students and activists, reached the doorsteps of the Indian president's residence on Saturday, protesting the vicious gang rape in a bus of a young woman. The 23-year-old medical student, who was thrown onto the road semi-naked after being beaten with an iron rod, is currently being treated in hospital. Public outrage over the attack is growing, with the incident highlighting for many the injustices faced daily by millions of Indian women. Several demanded the death sentence for the alleged rapists. This protester says the cruelty of the attackers was inhuman and she's now afraid of leaving her office at night. Police in India's eastern Bihar state have arrested a sixth and final man accused of the rape. They had earlier arrested a bus driver and four others, all identified from CCTV footage. Doctors treating the victim says she's slowly recovering. She's breathing on her own. She is communicating much better than yesterday. She is talking. New Delhi, India's capital, has the highest number of sex crimes among India's mega cities, with a rape reported in the city on average every 18 hours.